had been a chance for you to start with an opening statement, just talking about being here uh, at the championship. Wisconsin Whitewater is extremely excited to be at the championships. Um, we were one of those teams that were on the bubble, and we knew that we were talented enough to make the championships, but we weren't quite sure if we were going to make it in. Um, the moment that we found out that we were going to be competing, we were so excited, and all the hard work that we put in all season long paid off. Um, and then just talk about your uh, season overall. Mm -hmm. um, give me one second. The 2013-2014 season was a marathon. There, there's no one tournament that solidified our competing at the national championships this year. Um, all season long, we had to work as a team. Um, we had our ups, we had our downs, and our ability to have great team chemistry and work together on and off the lanes, I believe, is part of the reason that we are competing here again this year. Um, and talk about how your team, like mentally and physically, prepared for this championship. Our team ment mentally took a break off. Um, so many weeks of competing just was mentally grinding for all the ladies. Luckily, the week that the selections was made, we had spring break, so a lot of the ladies were able to have that week off. A lot of them did practice on their own, but they were able to kind of take that mental break. That Monday, when we came back from spring break, we were able to focus and just be ready to prepare for the nationals by just working hard on the lanes and just preparing as well in the classroom. And then talk about um, how it means personally to you to be coaching at the championships. For me, it's an amazing experience to be coaching here. Um, I was a player at UW-Whitewater, and we never thought we could ever make the national championship. Just being a D Division three university, competing at a Division one championship is an amazing feeling. For us, we're almost as an underdog, or a lot of the girls have a chip on their shoulder because they are non-scholarship athletes. For them, they love the game. If we win, we win because we love the game, not because we're getting paid to do so.